What's up everyone? So I decided to make this video on how kids feel about school based on a LinkedIn post I saw from Mike Yates. So in this post, Mike Yates was talking about how on TikTok, when you type in school makes me, the things that come up are drain, ugly, stress, feel empty, miserable, and certainly kids are really showing that they have a real negative attitude and experience with school. So shout out to Mike for highlighting that, for bringing that to the forefront. It's such a multi-layered problem though. So I'm in the school system. I'm in Chicago on the South side. I work at multiple schools. So I don't just work at one school. I work at like five different schools a week. Certainly, I think students have had a negative experience at school for many, 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 many years. Like when I went to school, I'm sure students had a negative experience towards school. So there have always been and always will be, in my opinion, students that have a negative experience towards school. We just didn't have TikTok back in the day. I, I, when I went to the school today, I asked students to share their thoughts. I gave them a piece of paper. I said it would be anonymous. I said they could actually put down their true feelings. I, I do want to add certainly other students, you know, the behavior, how other students act, I think plays a role in it. Certainly, I think the home environment plays a role in it too. So when it talks, when it comes to trying to fix the school experience and listening to students and hearing what they have to say, a lot of uh, other factors have to do with what takes place in the school and the actual learning and the experience. But here we go. Um, these are actual responses from sixth grade students. I would try to censor them um, from Chicago and certainly they're negative for sure. So here's what one student said. Boring, too much work. Teachers are lame. School is draining and boring because of the teachers and these kids. They stink. They make my head hurt. Forget this school. These kids are musty. Feels like hell. I got to wake up so early. I have to do so much work. I mean, but in the working world, a lot of times you have to wake up early as an employee and have to do a lot of work as well. So I think sometimes it's a disconnect. Jail, starving, let me leave. I'm not the only one who feels this way. Forget these teachers. Certainly, you know, the behavior and the way teachers treat students that factors into it prison hell these kids i would describe school as happy sad stressful okay i feel this way because school gives me a mix of emotions some parts make me happy some stressful some very 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 aggra aggravating emphasis on aggravating how would you describe school that's what i asked the students how would you describe school it's okay why do you feel that way? Because these people in this school is annoying and they think they are the dog poop. I feel fine. I don't like the classes. I hate the class. School can be fun sometimes when you have friends because some teachers are annoying. You don't have the annoying teacher. What is so wrong with these teachers? I, I hate it here. Hard to read that one. School is irritating. These teachers treat us like dog poop. The students don't listen. I hate school. How would you describe school? Math is boring. Capital letters. I like my other classes. I couldn't give two rats about math. Why do you feel that way? The math teacher be tripping. I'm cool with Miss Chanel and Mr. Townsend. Mr. Townsend will be me. I'm glad to hear they're cool with me. I hate school because they do too much. It's only 11 more days. These teachers are mean and the ugly rat kids. All right. So again, teachers and kids. I hate this school and the teacher. It's OK. People be irritating. They be doing a whole lot of dog poop. How do you describe school? I feel like Mike Juvie. I don't really know Mike Juvie. I, I don't listen to Mike Juvie. Why do you feel this way? This is so irritating. Certain classes are irritating. Feels like a prison because these teachers. School is full of. I feel this way because most people smell like and they are annoying. How would you describe school? School is bad and good at the same time. Why do you feel that way? I hate school because these kids are annoying. They do way too much. Some of the teachers do too much. Some people stinky, but you can't hate the player, hate the game. <laughs> 
Last one. How do I feel about school? AKA prison. The teachers are, they make the whole class get in trouble if one person messes up. My students are also, I hate them. I can't even have fun because they always want to do dog food. No home training. Think the teachers are their friends, but they aren't. Ugly kids can't even shut up for one second. Teachers be knowing I don't be doing and I still get in trouble because someone want to show their out like you got to be blind. So in that instance, reading between the lines, a lot of the students are acting up, misbehaving. Everybody gets punished because of the acts of a few. I'm in the classroom. Sometimes it's hard to avoid it. Sometimes two and three students, you know, are just disrupting the whole class. And it, at times you have to shut everything down to regain control of the class. Um, Multi-layer problem. Certainly there can be some changes made to schools. Um, in the post with Mike Yates, people were talking about listening to students and teachers and parents. Um, there'll always be, there will always be students who don't like school. Changes can be made. Certainly kids do hate school. So now what do we do about it? How do we take this information and take steps? How do we take this information and try to make sure that the experience is better and the students get what they need to be successful in life? I believe in education. Again, both of my parents were educators. My aunt, my cousin is in education. My sister is in education in France and I'm in Chicago schools five days a week, different schools. I believe education makes a difference. I'm here for the conversation. What can we do? How can we change it? What do we do with this information? Can't wait to hear your feedback.